Point one, the river. It's Murphy, Sam, and Jody, Our Lady of the Lake Children's Hospital Radiothon. Only 53 minutes left to become a miracle maker. It's a triple match that's going on right now, thanks to Cortana Kiwanis and a, uh, a very kind lady who called and wants to remain anonymous, and she's helping us with the triple match. So your $15 a month becomes 45 right now. If you want to do a one-time donation, you know, today was payday. Whatever you can donate is triple, just like that, 888 499 Five four three seven. Guys, we're visiting with a family um, that drove in to do this. That drives in a lot um, for the Mandeville area. Um, Aaron Sanji and her daughter Julia. Julia's nine years old. Uh, when she was six, you guys discovered that she had a disease. You were in for a tonsillectomy, is that right? And you found out All that right. she had this disease. And she's been a patient here for a long time, in and out, and had her spleen removed last year in in July. Right. Why did how did how did you come to make that decision that that was okay that you want that you wanted to do this? Uh, you did it to to give uh, Julia a better lifestyle that she could participate in sports again and continue to thrive as a young person and participate in all the things that she wanted to. Um, the staff here was just fabulous, from housekeeping to dietary to the nurses, uh, child life. Um, a lot of them have become very close friends of ours. They're always there for us, whether it was providing activities for Julia or listening to me. Yeah, you know, throw off. That's important. Uh, you know, things I was worried about or ideas I was trying to come to a conclusion on. They were always there for us. And uh, Julia, like you said, had her spleen out back in July. We had been a patient here for about two and a half years prior to that. We'd come every month and a half every mm. two months sometimes more sometimes less and i uh, came became like our home away from home julia can we talk about your surgery were you scared that day a little what do you remember um i remember my mom and dad standing by the door when i was coming in were they when you were going in who was with you and what were they saying to you my mom, she was just walking with me, and Miss Danielle. Yeah, I know Miss Danielle, child life specialist. What did she do for you on surgery day? Um, when I came out, she helped me uh, play the iPad. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I um, hear the rumor that you have said that they make it like a hotel for you. Yeah. What? How? How do they do that? Well, they have iPads. <laughs> <laughs> That's how they make it like room a hotel. Service. They take uh, care of room service. Room yeah. service. Yeah. yeah, they do Easy Mac and they bring it in for you, right? Yes. Yeah, I've been there too. 888-499-5437 is the number for you to call for kids like Julia. Yes, this could be your kid. This is She's one of ours. She's yep. one of ours in this community. 888-499-5437. Uh, since you're so young, I know this is kind of a big question, but you are nine years old, and you do seem very mature for nine. So I wanted to ask you this. Um, do you ever ask, do you ever wonder why this had to be you? Sometimes. What do you come up with? What answers do you... Every child's different. Like, I have a friend, she has diabetes, and she's she feels just like me, too. Yeah. And I think that was, um, that was very important. When we came here, we realized that it was a faith-based hospital mm -hmm. and that we were always surrounded by um, crosses and prayer and people coming to support and pray with us, and, and we could continue with that mission. You know, and helping other kids, mm -hmm. too, praying for them, praying for the staff that was helping us. And that was a really important part of us being here also. She has this. She had her spleen removed, and she has this this disease. What 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 are you told is going to be your future? How, do you expect to be here more? Not really. They told us that I, I would have to take the medicine twice a day, mm -hmm. but that was pretty much it. That's it. Congratulations yes, on good. that, baby girl. Hey, Thank Julia, you I got some good news. Somebody just called and, and made a donation. They want to remain anonymous. They, they, they just donated $200 on your Thank behalf. Thank you. Oh, that's sweet. It's for you, Julia. Julia just handed me a check. Can you tell me why you handed me a check? Yes. Why? Did you guys raise some money yourselves? Mm -hmm. You did? No, my dad did. Your dad. <laughs> okay, so your family's. $2,000. Oh. 
Your dad, Gary. Thank you so, so much. See, what's funny is that the families who have been through it and have been here, they understand. They yes. To give back. You give everything. For the rest of your life, you give everything you got, don't you? Yes. Spread the news far and wide that Our Lady of the Lake Hospital for Children in Baton Rouge is the best place to be. No matter what it takes to get here, you got to get here. If you need a reason, that's it. 888-499-5437. Right. This is the last 50 minutes for, our, for us to support our not-for-profit hospital, Children's Hospital, right here in Baton Rouge. 888-499-5437. I want to remind you quickly that this check is tripled yeah, right now because match. of the triple match that is happening. So whatever you can give, it is tripled. One more time, the number 888-499-5437. Murphy, Sam, and Jody with you tonight on 96.1 The River.